Okay, guys, we're back with video number four, and questions have been asked, Ted. Um, can you can you can you get started doing this with only one thousand, two thousand, maybe three thousand dollars? You can start with little money, but making money is going to be difficult for you. So let's use tax lien certificates. So let's say there's a house and it's got a $100,000 value and the tax is $3,000. So you could buy that one. Then if you bought it in, say, Florida, you could make up to 18% on your $3,000. All right, so that was a tax lien certificate. Now, the same house might have to be $100,000 and now they have defaulted on the tax lien. Now it's going to go for auction for five or seven thousand. Wow. What if you could go to that auction with just a little bit more money? My point is you can buy little stuff, but I'm here to tell you this is an investment business and get some friends together, get your relatives, work out a deal to pay them some real high interest, get a little pot of money together. We'll teach you how to do that if you want. Get a little pot of money together. This is a money business. I want to, I don't want to teach you to. To make two thousand or five thousand, that's not dead dollars. I'm an investor guy. I'm going to teach you to make twenty-five, fifty grand a deal. This is a business. I don't want you to do hundreds of deals. I want you to do a few deals, make twenty-five, fifty thousand dollars. I'd love to see you make fifty or hundred thousand this year. That's what I teach people. Yes, you can get small ones, but it's going to take you forever. I got guys that started there; they're still doing small deals. Let us teach you the real way to do it. Wow. Okay, Ted. Um, now, now this seems like this, um, and, and and for me, uh, you know, I've been doing real estate a long time, so it's definitely something I can do. But someone that this may be their first introduction to real estate of any form, in the form of uh, investing. What, what is there any complications or or I guess cons that uh, they need to know about before they get started? Um, yes and no. So the yes is. It's the real estate business. So there's always little nuances in the real estate. Obviously, if you're buying and trying to do lease options and things like that, or you're trying to buy and be a wholesaler, or you're trying to be a flipper, or you're trying to be a renovator, all of those are businesses within themselves. What we're specialists at is we're specialists at one thing only, and that's tax defaulted property. We're going to teach you to buy property 10, 20, 30 cents on the dollar. We don't even mind if you pay a little bit more than that, but we're going to teach you to buy for a bargain. Then we're going to teach you that what nobody else does. Everybody else says, buy a property, buy it low and sell it high. Well, that sounds good, but it's not so easy to do. So we teach you to buy it low and then sell it low to a renovator or a fixer-upper person or one of those people. Why? Because we want to get your cash flow going. All right, now once your cash flow is moving, then you're going to find out that you're going to feel comfortable. Once you get a check, you're feeling great. We can't teach you everything in one six-hour class. Now, we do that every month. We can't teach you. So we're not going to tell you, all right, you can come into this and you're going to be rich in six months. I got plenty of people that I'll show you during that class that are plenty rich, but this is going to take a little while. But here's what we have and nobody else has. We have properties that are coming online and being sold for as low as $100, not from me, but from the government. And what we have is we have abundance of new properties every year. So this business does not go up and down, up and down, up and down. We're right like this all the time. I come from the real estate business. I'm a foreclosure guy. If you go back and look, check with the trademark office, I own the name, Mr. Foreclosure. I did that for years. But when I found mm -hmm. out about tax liens and deeds, folks, I never looked back. Where are you going to buy property for 10 and 20 cents on the dollar? There is wow. no other place. Wow. Yeah, a lot of the people that are watching here are investors, wholesalers, and um they uh, have the expectations or have actually done deals where they made uh, twenty to $50,000. So I'm assuming you can do the same with this and more. Well, you can, you can, if you're starting out with twenty-five dollars or $50,000, I'm going to show you many case histories in that six-hour class of people that did a lot less than twenty-five dollars and $50,000 to get started. I will show you. I will guarantee to show you many. I don't have time in, the, in this our last video to do that. But if you've got that kind of money, you've got somewhere between ten and fifty thousand dollars. You're gonna you're gonna start off just like that. You're gonna go because you're gonna see that we have access to twenty five hundred, three thousand counties online, folks. You 
You might buy your first property in Seattle. You might buy your first property in Michigan. You don't necessarily have to buy the one next door because we can do this online and we can teach you how to do that. We can teach that kind of system. Wow. Wow. All right. Um, so um, many of the uh, people watching, um, grandmothers, grandfathers, uncles, and we, there's so much stuff out there uh, on real estate investing from, from A to Z. Um, work For the working person and the love to make $50,000 in one year, is this really for them? Is this really the, one of the few opportunities that will allow them to do this and happen quickly? Okay, I'm going to answer this question as honestly as I can. And that is, first of all, it's a business of abundance. Why do we have abundance? Because nationwide, 3,000 counties are going to auction properties. So I'm going to show you a video in a minute of a couple that live in Wisconsin, but they wanted to buy in Michigan. The reason they wanted to buy in Michigan is because they could get properties and start out with a business under 25,000. So they went to Michigan, they bought their first property at auction for $8,000. Now it wasn't pristine and pretty. It was just a basic house that someone had lived in. They went and cleaned it up. All right, they did just what we said. We teach people how to market it. So they did a lot of things very quickly. They put up signs on it like we told them, but they didn't fix it up. They put up signs on it. They put it on eBay, they put it on Craigslist, put it on Trulia, put it on the multiple list. So you get the idea, they really were aggressive. Next thing you know, the buyer came from Facebook Marketplace. All mm. right, now they bought the property for 8,000. They put 4,000 in cleaning it up. They put it up for sale for 25,000. That was their first deal. So they had 12,000. They thought if they doubled their money, their first offer was 35,000. It was 10,000 more than they were trying to sell it for. So wow. they sold the property for 35. Now wait, it gets better because we also taught them, why don't you be the banker? So I'll teach you how to be a banker. What do you mean to be a banker? Why don't we accept payments instead of all the cash? So they're accepting payments for another 10 years on that property. So first they made 20, 23,000 selling it. Then they made another $15,000 doing the mortgage on the property. They get $400 a month, $400 a month for 10 years. Now let me review. They bought it for eight. They put four in. They sold it and made 23,000. They made another 15,000 on, on the mortgage. And guess what? They're going to make $48,000 on a $12,000 total investment. So you want to get into a business? Try and find one like that. Everybody else wants you to buy and sell. I'll show you how to buy and have long-term wealth. 10 years of 400 bucks a month, those people are going to get paid. What if you did? Well, they did. They did all that, by the way, between Thanksgiving and Christmas. Everybody says, you can't sell property Thanksgiving and Christmas. Folks, when you got the right property at the right price, they bought it low, they sold it low, and they offered financing. That's what we we'll teach you how to do. I'll show you how to do those deals in the six-hour class that I do every single month. I want to make sure that you guys get signed up for it. My name is Robert Hagan, but everybody calls me Sonny. And this is my wife, Marsha. In September of 2019, uh, we took the Ted Thomas classes. In November, we won the Fraser Street House. December, we accepted an offer already. January, we closed on it. It's it's amazing about the signs. You know, we we didn't even think anything about this sign stuff. And it was brought to our attention by uh, Ted that, you know, this is, this is a surefire way to get people's attention. And he's absolutely right. The lawyer cost us $600 to do the closing and set up the land contract that we sold it on. So altogether, uh, $11,557, uh, almost $12,000. Uh, the purchase price turned out to be $35,000 with a profit of $23,443. Once we plugged all this in, it came up with that his payments would be $411. Total interest then, the interest made on all the money that was in here, just the interest, it amounts to $15,995.51. So that's just the interest, that's just profit. Basically, we hold the note on the on the property, we're the bank. It was $23,443 profit on the sale. And $15,995 profit on the note. So all of our investment, which of course we've already gotten back, 
and the profit on the property and the profit on the note. So the total for just the profit part, not our investment, but the total profit part is $39,438. And I think for that $12,000, that's a pretty good deal. Wow. Uh, now, I know that was an amazing deal. Is that the best deal you ever heard of or well, ever the best seen? One, the best one, um, I'm sure you two that are the best two. One was a guy in Georgia, uh, and uh, he was a newspaper editor. He bought a house for 300 bucks, which shocked me, and then, he, and then he rented it out. But I'm going to show you this video again because you'll really appreciate it. This guy has been a student. He is from Georgia, right next to where you are, and he's done over 100 deals. And you're just going to be shocked. He bought this property and he bought it for less money than you and I could buy dinner at Denny's. Here he is. I'd have to say that the best uh, dollar for dollar deal I've ever done on a piece of land it happened in Oklahoma. I went out to an outlying county and I bought a tax lien. The tax lien was on a 25 acre piece of land. The tax lien was only $67.12. Uh, you'd think that nobody would ever abandon a piece of land for that small of a tax bill, but things like that do happen. And guess what? Those people never did pay that tax. They never redeemed that tax lien, and I ended up getting the tax deed to that property. I eventually sold that piece of land for $22,500. It's not uncommon to make ten dollars or $20,000 off of a deal. Okay, you saw it. $67 he paid, and he sold it for $20,000. Folks, this is a money business. If you want to make money, we can show you how to do that. I'm going to have an all-day, one-day workshop. Ty will be there watching too, just like you. Be there. It costs $47. I'm a business guy. I'm not an internet marketer. So you want to come, I'm going to charge you a little bit to be there. If you're not happy with what you got, just tell me. We'll give you money back. People rave about this class. It's six hours. We'll teach you from A to Z about tax liens. I'm going to bring all my coaches. I'm going to bring my facilitators. This is the real deal. We'd love to have you be, be there. Uh, we're running out of time for Ty and I, but I tell you what, we did four videos. You go back and watch them all. You'll learn a lot. We're really glad to have met you and we'll look forward to seeing you. You can just go below me and register. So I'll leave it up to you, Ty. Thanks, Ted, man. It's been amazing, amazing uh, four videos here, guys. Um, you got to come in uh, and uh, join this class that we're going to have all day. Uh, so make sure you clear your schedule and, um, and and get ready to learn in those six hours. So, again, I appreciate uh, Ted for uh, sharing all of his knowledge and um, giving us this opportunity, uh, giving my audience, people who like to follow what I have to say, this opportunity to get into another Another way of making real estate, which you know I'm always about trying to get you get you more money. So again, Ted, we appreciate your time. And as I always like to say with guys, we'll see you on the flip side.